Hey everyone, this is Randy from BibleBuyingGuide.com and I'm here with Lucinda and she's going to help me do a repair. If you've uh, seen thin paper, then you've probably seen the crinkle page that comes in just after the thicker end sheets on some of these Bibles. And there, trust me, there's nothing you can do to make that flatten out. You can set stacks of Bibles on this like I have did this one for a week and it just it will not... It will not go back. That's but now there's an easy way to fix this, and that is to use this tape right here, or tape similar to this document repair tape. So what we're going to do is we're going to cut this tape, and then we're going to use this folding tool, and and then we're going to get the tape put down the way it should be, and it's going to look nice. Here's another example. We've seen uh, you've seen this in some of my videos. Fortunately, it's easy to fix. Now, this, this will also fix cuts and tears. So if you have a page that's torn, you can fix it just like this, and it's going to work exactly the same. So the very first thing we need to do is to clear outer space. I'm going to work on this one first, or Lucinda's going to, actually. And she's already cut the tape. So here's what we've done. We've cut the tape to match the size we need. And you just cut that with scissors. All you do there is just set it up next to the Bible and cut, cut it with scissors. And then what I'm going to do is sit back here and play my guitar. I mean, what I meant to say is what I'm going to do is hold this while Lucinda puts the tape on here. So first thing we need, I think it needs four hands. So the first thing we need to do is flatten it out as much as you can. And now sometimes you'll need to, to rub on the edge a little bit to get it to flatten out better. And then hold it down while, some, while someone tapes. And this is easier to do when you're not trying to do this under a camera. Now, we'll trim this out. It won't be a problem at all. And uh, you can put some on the other side if you want to. It doesn't matter. It's just however you want to do it. One problem I have run into, though, is on another on another one. Let me get out of her way as much as I can here. She's got scissors near my Bible. I want to get out of her way. We, we've repaired this one last year. And you can see here where we've repaired it. After the repair, it worked great for a while, but then it started to wrinkle again. You can probably see that little wrinkle right there. So probably what we need to do is to put another piece of tape or maybe put a piece of tape across or something. I'm not real sure yet how to handle that. Maybe put a piece on the back. That might be the better thing. But, um, but yeah, that, that's an easy way to fix it. Trust me, it will look better after it sits for a little bit. But, and it's easier to do when you're not trying to do this under a camera at an awkward angle. But, uh, yeah, that's uh, an easy repair. I highly recommend this tape, document repair tape, and this, acid -free. it's acid-free document repair tape, and then this um, paper, e paper creaser or folding and burnishing tool, also called a bone folding tool. So if you have any questions, let me know. I'll put some links in the, in the notes where you can uh, buy all these tools, and hopefully this helps. Thanks.